Hello, everybody, and welcome to today's Full Potential Show. I'm James Rick, and this is your number one non-boring source for personal development. And today on the line, we have Adam Heller, speaker, coach, and author of Zero Pain Now. So the theme for today's show is if you are in pain, we've got the solution for you today, my friends. Um, Adam has developed new techniques that empower people to change their behaviors and overcome problems so that they're able to produce success and achieve your full potential. Gosh, what a perfect guest for today. Three years ago, Adam began examining the link between physical pain and emotions. He expanded on a rich body of evidence supporting this theory of what came to be known as diversion pain syndrome, DPS. We're going to talk about that and how in 97% of the cases that Adam has worked with, He's not only resolved their issues, but often done it within hours. So an incredible record. Adam, thank you for being on today's Full Potential Show. Thank you for having me. I'm looking forward to it. Well, we're here, and, and so we don't have much more doing to look forward to because we're, we're on it, and I'm excited to have you here. I want to dive right in and talk about the zero pain now. How did you discover, first of all, this, this therapy, and, and who benefits mostly from your discovery? Great question. I spent years helping people learn how to control their brain to enable them to have success and in, in solve big problems. So people would come to me going through a divorce or getting over the loss of a loved one or with fears or phobias or money problems. And they would come to me and, and many times in, in a five hour session, I would help them solve their problem. But it was really interesting. They would be telling me about their problem, divorce or whatever it is. And then they'd say, you know, and I have terrible back pain or my neck hurts or I need knee surgery or all these things. So I realized there had to be some kind of link between the stress, the tension, mm. the tumult and chronic and persistent pain. Mm. So I started researching it. I knew, you know, I, I thought I could help people even more if I could, if I could solve this problem. So I found out there was a doctor, John Sarno at NYU, who 15 years had figured out that the cause of almost all uh, chronic ongoing persistent pain actually originates in the brain psychologically. Mm. There are actual physical changes that take place. The end result is pain. So I studied everything he did and, and he took it, you know, he took it so far. Uh, so I, I redid the work that he had done. I took his science and then I took all the techniques I was using to help people learn to control their brains and I put together the program that's called Zero Pain Now. Yeah. And I started testing it and testing it. And the amazing thing is people would come to me and they'd been told they need surgery or they'd had surgery or diagnosed with fibromyalgia or something like that. And 85% and of the time inside of a session, their pain would completely disappear. Some took a little longer, but 97% but of the people that have come to me in person have become completely pain-free and gotten their lives back and they're playing golf and playing with their mm. kids and running and jumping and having a great life. Now, so the root of this work is from a, a, an orthopedic surgeon at NYU who's been studying this for more than 15 years. I mean, this is a, a doctor that's been studying people's bones and the pains and the bulging discs and everything. And he's come up with this connection between the psychological effects the psychological causes that are producing the pain in the body there is a direct link and he's made it very very clear through his research that that's what's going on i mean that's 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 an interesting discovery and then you took that work and you advanced it what you're doing now but i i mean i just want to make that clear this is a doctor who's an orthopedic surgeon who discovered this serious and significant and clear evidence that there's a link between what's going on psychologically and the pain that's happening in the body, right? That's exactly right. And, and you know, it was after, just for the record, it was after 20 years of doing surgeries and back surgeries and neck surgeries. And what he realized was people weren't getting better. Their pain was either coming back or it was going to some other part of the body, but it wasn't solving. And studies came out and, and, and some incredible studies. Uh, one that I quote a lot is Hogue Hospital, which is here in Newport Beach. And the Cleveland Clinic did a study and they took 198 people who had never had any back pain. They gave them MRIs. Two out of every three had bulging discs or herniated discs, yet they've never had pain. So you start to look at these things. You start to see, well, if, if person A has the same structure as person B and one has pain and one doesn't, it can't be the structure. Hmm. So 
Yes. It, well, that the makes, results are That astounding. makes perfect sense. Yeah. All right. So now let's talk about what is the psychological factor that causes this pain. What is what are the most common factors that you see? And then we'll start talking about how you you resolve those, how you neutralize those with your zero pain now strategy. So what are what are some of the most common factors that cause this pain in the body? Well, there's really one factor that causes the pain in the body, and it has to do with the way we process emotions. We all have some self-image. It has to do with repressed emotions. We all have a self-image. There are certain emotions in certain circumstances that are not okay. The example I give a lot of the time is a mother who has a special needs kid, and she sees herself as a good mother, so it's not okay to be angry at a kid in a wheelchair. At the same time, it would be impossible not to, because none of us bargained for a 24-7 yeah. upheaval like that. So what the good mother does is she basically unconsciously represses the emotions. She goes and she takes care of that kid, and she does a great job. Next thing you know, she's got back pain or neck pain or mm. knee pain or some kind of pain because th that emotion isn't okay. So the brain is giving a diversion. That's why it's called diversion pain syndrome. It's giving a diversion so that she doesn't deal with this emotion that is considered unbearable. Mm. So the, it, it, it's really simple. When people understand exactly what's causing pain, and it's, it's hard to believe because for, for your whole life and all of our whole lives, we've been told that these structural abnormalities are the cause of pain, and they're not. Mm -hmm. So when people understand it, what the zero pain now process is really, one, to teach people what's going on, and two, a technique to unrepress the emotion. And, and I see it every day. All of a sudden, people get to the emotion and the pain's gone. It's just all of a sudden there's no pain and it stays that way. Okay, so the one factor that's causing this pain is repressed emotion of some kind. It's, right. not, it's not getting out. It's not releasing. Emotion is really an energy that needs to flow. It's getting, it's getting held in for some reason. It's get well it as a protective mechanism it's it's really just being repressed because it's to the unconscious mind it's it's unbearable and it's not okay it's not better okay to, the, it's it's illogical better to be suffering through debilitating pain than realize you're angry at your wife or your kid or your mother or your boss or your whatever that just isn't okay so, and there are certain Go ahead. It's a form of subconscious repression because you're you're not even wanting to be conscious of the emotion. Is, is that right. it? I, on a subconscious level, you're saying it's Absolutely. not even okay to be aware of this emotion. Therefore, it's better to divert attention from the emotion to a pain. It's like a survival strategy. It's exactly that. It's a coping mechanism for sure. And when all you have to do to fix the pain, and again, the numbers of people with with horrible medical diagnoses that have come to see me or bought these programs and healed their pain. All you have to do is acknowledge and get the emotion. When your unconscious mind gets that you consciously get the emotion, the pain disappears on the spot. And I want to point something out. I'm not saying that the pain is in your head or your listener's heads or anybody's head. It isn't. It, origi it just doesn't originate in the spine. So it starts in the brain, and there are actual physical changes that take place. Mm. Blood vessels constrict. There's less blood flow. There's oxygen in blood, and it's actually an oxygen deprivation that's causing the pain. That's why people put heat on their back pain, and it feels a little better for a little while. The heat certainly doesn't unherniate a disc. What it does is increase blood flow which brings some oxygen for a little while until you take the heat off. And this is an important distinction because a doctor can look at it and say, oh no, there's, there's definitely, I don't know what you were talking about, you know, that show with Adam and James, there is a problem here and we need to operate or we need to do something here. You're saying that it's real. Like you're not saying that it's in the head, but you're saying that the disturbance that caused that bodily symptom that is very real in medical terms, that condition began as a cause in the mind psychologically as a survival strategy that happened right right and i'm not saying that these structural abnormalities aren't there i'm two out of every three people watching this right now that have never had pain have bulging discs or herniated discs they're there they're just they're normal parts of aging doing surgery on that is like doing surgery on this gray hair it's benign <laughs> yeah right okay <laughs> that's a good example all right, so we're in this situation where the factors that are causing us to have pain begin psychologically, but then they spread to our physical body. I mean, that much is clear. Now, you're saying that 
most of these situations, are they reversible or does it get to a point where it's gone too far and that they do need the surgery? Or what is your take on that? 97% of the cases can be resolved. 97% of the people that have come to see me have become pain-free. Study after study after study, even neurosurgeons have said that, that only 3% of herniated discs actually cause pain. So I'm not saying that the structure gets resolved because if there's a, th these are normal aging okay, things. Okay, gotcha. You know, shy gotcha. of Grecian formula, the gray hair is staying. Yeah. But <laughs> it isn't, it has nothing to do with the pain. So almost everybody that has chronic persistent recurrent pain and I'm not talking about you go out and you sprain your ankle if you break your foot it hurts mm -hmm. six weeks later it's healed so anything that lasts more than six weeks or keeps coming back typically is diversion pain syndrome and that's where zero pain now has been incredibly effective helping people become pain-free now Adam does this apply to just bone structure or does this apply also to some of the internal organs and stuff that that are affected by again psychological causes or, or you know is that out of the realm of the work that you do well I'm talking about all what I, well here's here's what I'm not talking about let me make it simpler um, and, and I have everybody for the record I, I, I am a fan of allopathic medicine in many cases just not here so so before I'll see anybody I always have them get checked out by a licensed medical doctor there are some horrible organic things that cause pain cancer being one so this this isn't mind over matter so it's not going to take care of that kind of pain that is a it's a physically caused pain so that needs to be ruled out okay. I haven't had any knock wood out of all the people that have come to see me nobody has ever gone to the doctor and received that diagnosis so all of the conventional ones the structural ones the tendonitis got gotcha. you okay. tunnel, the tennis elbow fibromyalgia being a massive one all of those fit into this paradigm and are very, e very easily fixable, okay. curable, healable. And, and I'm glad we made the distinction. So there are some ongoing chronological pains that may not fall under this paradigm. But for the most case, the structural things, the bulging discs, all, all the conditions that you just mentioned that I couldn't probably even repeat, <laughs> all of those okay. fall under a psychological cause that once that emotion is released, they can see almost immediate results, almost an immediate yeah, I, I would, of energy. It is immediate because all of a sudden the pain goes away and it's, it's the most amazing thing. And I have with the, 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 my, my kind of number one package, which is the virtual session, we have an entire session, two hour session on video that I did with a TV producer. And it's amazing because you can watch how somebody is in debilitating pain and all of a sudden on the spot the pain goes away. And it sounds implausible until you see it. And I see it every day and all of a sudden it, it, the pain is gone and people are, are doing, I call it the zero pain now dance, which is kind of a mixture between an 80 year old Jewish man and Michael Jackson because they start <laughs> to do this like tweaking because they're looking for the pain, but the pain isn't there. I feel good. All right, so we got yeah, this. Exactly. We got this. <laughs> we got the zero pain now. Uh, it's actually a program that you can get on the website zeropainnow.com. Now I know it's a book, but you highly recommend that they get the program because that's where they're going to get the full benefit of what you have to offer. Is that right? Absolutely. Since the key, the cure to pain, and this is a hard one, no pun intended, a hard pill for some people to swallow because they've been brainwashed otherwise. The key to becoming pain-free is understanding. So the more information you can get, the better off you're going to be. I have had tremendous results from people just buying a book. I've had even better results from people buying our, you know, one of the programs and even better with the, the virtual session. So uh, listen, it, whatever somebody can afford, these are not expensive. Pe you know, people probably spend more than this on Advil in a given year. Um, these are really proven programs and, and frankly, they're guaranteed. And these are these are permanent changes too, right? It's not like they do it and then they come back. It's like unless they're doing the same thing that caused it, this is this is a permanent solution to the pain. It's 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 a it's a you said it exactly right too. The programs are twenty eight day programs. Even though most people become pain free really quickly, if you change the way you think and your pain goes away, if you went back to thinking the way you used to, what would it's happen? Come pain back. would come back. So 
the program has been designed to be long enough so that you change the way you automatically process emotions so that not only does the pain go away, but it stays away. Okay, it's at zeropainnow.com. There is a 15% discount. By the way, Full Potential gets none of this, but if you mention the code Full Potential, he's already heavily discounted the items. He's going to give an additional 15% off of the programs. So if you are in pain and this fits you know, the bill, I mean, this is the kind of pain that you're having. You're going to want to check this stuff out. I mean, this is a way to resolve it permanently as long as you recondition these new patterns, which sounds like what the 28 days is all about. Um, yeah. Before we wrap up, Adam, I do want to leave folks with maybe a few things they can apply, even if they don't get the program in the book. Although if you're in pain and like you said, you're investing in pain meds, why wouldn't you? But, you know, starting right now, maybe to see some of the results for themselves. Are there any suggestions that you can give before we wrap up today's show? Absolutely. And, and, and to point out, there are certain personality types that are even more likely to get this. Any one of them will do. Some people are more perfectionist, do-gooders people that are sensitive to criticism, people that are religious or spiritual, um, people that are slightly compulsive, people that are very dependable. If you meet any of those things and you have pain, more than likely that's the cause. The way to get out of it is to start focusing on your emotions. It can be done quickly. Uh, real quickly, I was at a friend's house who was heading for MRI. This was Friday night. She was heading for MRIs Monday morning. Her husband's the head of a major ER uh, at, at a major hospital and she was in debilitating pain and she, she asked me if I could help her. I wanted to get out of there because her husband's a doctor and I really didn't want to get involved in that. <laughs> I gave her five minutes about zero pain now and that she fits, she fits the criteria. She's a perfectionist and super dependable and mm -hmm. taking things to the homeless all the time. Great person. Two hours later she called me. 35 years of pain were gone. Unbelievable. That's all it took her to do. So, so my advice to any of you is if you're, if you're having pain, start to pay attention to your emotions. That's where the success is. The, the more you understand what's really going on, that it originates psychologically, there are physical changes in your body, you can fix the problem. You, you need to believe it. So that's why the education is so yeah. important. Give up anything you're doing to structurally fix the problem because it isn't structural. Start focusing on your emotions and I guarantee you can heal your pain. It really does sound like an awareness exercise and an awareness of the emotion, an awareness of what could be causing it, an awareness of the patterns that you've been running. And also, and this is a big one, and, and being that you're a, a master in NLP, an NLP trainer, you probably see this a lot too, an identification with the pain that also has to be removed because otherwise somebody could be like, oh, no, 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 this can't work for me. I'm, I've been in pain for X number of years and for it to be resolved almost overnight is almost a, a contradiction of the identity of the, I'm just a person who's in pain. You're exact. You're, you're, you're very right. And I'm not asking anybody to believe what I'm saying. I'm, if you want to become pain free, take a moment and suspend disbelief long enough to try it. And, and judge for yourself because the, the, the record is stellar. Mm. So okay. it, it's, it's really doable. Awesome. Uh, Adam Heller, the uh, program is called Zero Pain Now. The website is zeropainnow.com. If you mention the code full potential, you get 15% off of the uh, two programs that you see on there. And um, you can, I'm sure you can reach out to Adam right there if you want to do a virtual session, right? They can just go right on the website. They can get it there. There's one-on-one -on -one sessions. Frankly, okay. they can pick up the phone and call me if they have questions or, or either or somebody I've trained, but most of the time they get me. So we're here to help. Okay, Adam, awesome. And if you're wanting to start practicing this stuff right away, raise your level of awareness to your emotion. Like notice what's going on there and believe that it's possible if you're aware and you're in tune that the emotions that were repressed might start relieving themselves. Right, Adam? I mean, am I, am I there? Is that what, is that what the you're, final? You're there. It's okay. The, the, you don't have to solve the problem. You don't have to do anything with the emotions. Not a bad idea to have a great life. All you have to do is unrepress what's buried. And, and by definition, they're not there because they're repressed. So anybody watching this probably doesn't believe that there's any emotion there because it's out of their awareness by it's buried, definition. It's underneath the carpet, but you got it, it. It's still affecting you. It's an energy. It's unlike dirt that you can sweep under a rug. This is energy. It's charged up and it's affecting you at the foundation. 
Yeah. So get a book, get a program. It's guaranteed. If you don't like it, send it back. Awesome. Adam Heller, the website is zeropainnow.com. Adam, it was a pleasure having you on the show, my friend. Thank you so much. I've enjoyed it. Me too. Everybody watching and listening right now, be sure and check out the website and be sure and like and subscribe to The Full Potential Show so you get more great insights from people like Adam and freebies that you'll only find right here on The Full Potential Show. Have a great afternoon, everybody. And Adam, wherever you are in the world, have a great afternoon, my friend. And you as well. Thank you. All right. Thanks, Adam. Bye-bye. Well, that concludes this week's episode of The Full Potential Show, your number one non-boring source for personal development. I'm James Rick, and if you want to get more positive programming for your brain absolutely free on a weekly basis, just visit fullpotential.com. If you like The Full Potential Show, you're going to love The Full Potential Club. What would you like most as a Full Potential Club member? Be two to three times more productive? Do what you're passionate about? Have more energy? Reduce your work hours? Travel the world? Enjoy an amazing lifestyle on a frugal budget? What if you could do them all? James Rick has been there and done it in ways that few people have. For anyone serious about taking their life or business to the next level, you know you've got to do more than just watch. You've got to do. Join James Rick and other like-minded people for an incredible $10 a month at fullpotential.com slash club. Be educated. Be empowered. Be the best version of you. Fullpotential.com slash club. Try it free for 30 days.